Hi, this is Vicki with Condi Systems Tech Support, and I'm going to show you how to use Corel Draw and create a PDF file within Corel. This should work with all your Corel Draw versions, um, with most any file that you would save or create using vector or bitmap images. So once you have a document open and you have something on the page, which here I have a I have a template. Um, we're going to use that as a demonstration. I, I am in Corel Draw X4, but this would work for X5, X3, all the earlier versions of Corel Draw up to 9 that I know of and probably even before. So once you have your graphic or your template, which I have on the page, uh, you can come over to File and Publish to PDF. And once you uh, get this page open, or this dialog box opens up, you have different uh, save as file types. You also have some PDF presets that you can use for uh, detailing your saved item. Here you'll name your file, which this is a SLD06, which is the headband, our new headband. And um, at this point, it's a PDF. Uh, I can go ahead and select it here, it's already pre-selected, or I can just whichever exit out because I have it selected in my save, save as type. So PDF is a great format for using with both Adobe Illustrator. It's a convertible file. It will work with most any um, uh, graphic programs. Um, it's a great way to save items when you're not quite sure um, what format the other person, if you're sending a file, what format they need, PDF is a great way to uh, to uh, interchange files. Now that I have that, I'm going to click Save. And it's asking me if I want to override it, which I'm just going to say yes, because I'd already had it saved. So again, this is how you create a PDF file with, from, from within Corel Draw. And that Save, Publish to PDF, and then um, change your settings as you need to. Again, this is Vicki with Condi Systems Tech Support and I hope this has helped. Thank you for your time.